everyone welcome back to my channel how you guys doing today today I'm gonna be trying to make a uh, footed pajamas um, a whole body pajama for my girls um, I got this pattern uh, but uh, I got this pattern from uh, peekaboo and it tells you um, how to follow the directions it gives you the measurements and all everything you need and pictures and it demonstrates how to cut it and all that so I'm gonna attempt to do that and you basically buy it they sent you the email and you download it and you print out the pattern and you cut it the way it requires so here it's already all this is the sleeve it's all cut up it has the different sizes on here and it tells you how to cut it um, and in the directions and all that so this is two pieces of paper and I taped it up and then so that this is considered the sleeve and you go along the sleeve size and cut along that and follow the lines and all that so it has the measurements on here for the kids um, I measure my daughters and so far it's not the size that they wear but the measurements are I'm gonna follow the measurements what they give me and um, I'm gonna do uh, those those sizes because this fabric does stretch this is a fleece fabric um, I bought this on Joanne and um, it does stretch so I'm gonna go ahead and start cutting the pieces out first and you're gonna need if it's up to you um, this is for pajamas and slippers you put this on the bottom of the pajamas I bought this on Amazon um, so I'm gonna um, use this for the under for the footed so they don't slip and stuff like that and I also you're gonna need zipper it tells you what zipper um, you need this I bought it at a website I'm not even sure what website it was I ordered this a while ago this is um, since you really uh, if you want to do a whole body zipper closer closure pajama then you would have to buy this um, at a website that sells really long zippers and so I got two of them one in black and one in uh, cream for my girls and then at the bottom you can add this elastic um, for the footed area like the picture here you can add this on there um, it's a preference um, it depends how um, how things come out for me um, I haven't decided to use this but I think I am so some things that I need to use to make this footed long this uh, footed pajama for my girls and you're also and also need the snap tab the metal snap tab the uh, uh, snap um, I already have the snap for the um, top of the pajama so this is um, for the foot this is a snap tab um, this is I think for the heel in the back of the foot is really big this is for the upper footed whole body pajama um that I taped it all together it, all the pieces come one um one piece at a time and you have to just cut it along the measurements of this uh whole thing so I'm gonna get started and start cutting the pieces out So I'm cutting two pieces because um, the size that I need for the girls is going to be 2T and 4T. So I need two of the same size. So that's why I have it on the folded edge and cutting two pieces. But it, it requires one for one. Sleeve is cut for one of the kids. This is, uh, you need two of these. So that is cut out. Now I gotta go and cut the other sleeve make sure it's on the folded side so you're going to take this and uh this is the folded edge this is uh where you're cutting you're not cutting this side you're cutting around th 
this side and so this is the one size and then I'm gonna go ahead and cut the other size of the sleeve for my other daughter so, all right so it's set up now to get cut it's on the folded edge here and I'm gonna cut around it all right so this is the front back of the pattern that I need to cut up so right now um, I already have the 4T set up and so I'm gonna cut this on the folded edge of the pat of the fabric and so this is just gonna be cutting this and then I'm not gonna be cutting this this is just gonna be a folded edge what I will be cutting will be from down here I will have to cut um, that up on the folded edge all right so the back piece it's all cut up um, so I had to cut around this front part of the pattern and the back part on the folded edge. And that's what it's starting to look like. No! That's the back part. This is the back part of the folded pajama and that's the bottom of the foot where the folded uh, pajama is going to go in there. So that's what it's starting to look like. All right, so my pieces are cut. This is for the foot, the non-slip uh, fabric. Um, this is for the foot also, and then the crotch area, the front of the foot pieces. This is for the tab on top of the um, pajama. I got the sleeves cut up already. Um, two sleeves, and then I have the front this is the front of the pajama with the bottom for the foot got two pieces of that right and left then we have this is the back of the pajamas which uh, the pants and then I have the neck it gives me the measurements for the neck um, binding for the pajamas the cuffs for the arms to go around the wrist um, and it, it's two pieces of that and then this is the zip the zipper shield that I have that it gives me also the measurements for the zipper shield so I have all my pieces cut out um, so on the printout it tells you what to do every every step of the way it tells you everything you need to do um, I find it very simple and easy uh, to use this pattern you know I do recommend checking them out um, and check out what uh, patterns they have and everything so um, I'm gonna go ahead and get started on my next step which is it requires to do the upper foot area first so that's what I'm gonna do first and um good thing it shows you the pictures and all that then the, the elastic i have my two elastic pieces it said um for the size of her foot is three inches so i already got the pieces for that um to put together so i'm gonna go ahead and get started on sewing the bottom of the foot <laughs> 